Hey, welcome back to another episode where me and Nick lose our minds as a car dealer. <laughs> so, uh, we wanted to film stuff for the car dealership when we buy cars and sell cars and so on and so forth. So this is our newest purchase. It is an Infiniti G37. And um, he went to pick it up and it wasn't running. And it wouldn't, it wouldn't like the accelerator wouldn't work and stuff like that. Uh, it ran through the sale. So we tried to do arbitration. There's like a thing you do with arbitration, try to get your money back because the car wasn't as advertised or whatever. So we tried to do that. And because it being red light, and that means you buy the car, there is some issues, but you're going to fix it. That's basically what that means. You're not guaranteed a running good car if it's red light. So, but they do inspect it. But they do inspect it. So that's why we buy from Odessa. Okay, perfect example. The windows were working in the pictures. So we get to... Oh yeah, we'll show you this real quick. This is the stupidest shit we have come across, and we've come across this in two to three cars already. You see that? It's unplugged. That is the most ridiculous thing I've ever seen in my life. Try to work it. Fuck. I hate being a car dealer. Okay, so this is what happened. The car wasn't running and the windows were stuck down. The car would crank, but it was running rough. It throw in a code. So what we did was he loaded it up on the trailer. He had to winch it up because it wouldn't drive. The accelerator wasn't working. And it threw a VVT, VVT code or something like that. Get it here. We're looking over it. We're, 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 our minds are blown. We're like going through it thinking it's electronic. Something's wrong. We're checking the computer. You know, we're doing all kinds of stuff, trying to figure this out. Windows are not rolling up and down, it won't lock. We're like, what the hell is wrong with this car? Um, we're about to give up, and I'm about to go home. And I pull the cap, the plastic off the top of the motor right here. All right, and in the back back there, you see that, or this, sorry. So that right there <laughs> was unplugged. <laughs> Nick is thinking we have somebody that doesn't like us up at Odessa and they're just unplugging our shit because this is the third car this has happened to. Um, so that was unplugged. I plugged it up. Car runs and drives. We drove it down the road and back. All right. Now the windows. we got to figure out what's wrong with the windows. Nick's like, I'm going to just pull the master out and see what's going on. Unplugged. Now the windows work. So, we figured everything out so far. So now we just got to figure out. Now we just got to. I didn't have yeah, he didn't have tech door panel. On. So now the windows work. The car runs and drives. So now we got to do. We're gonna get an oil change. We usually do the oil change on all cars, um, but we're gonna do an oil change. And possibly, no, we was going to do brakes because the brakes wasn't working. But now that that's fixed, the brakes are working. So it like shut everything down. You couldn't use your brakes. You couldn't use your throttle. Like it was, it was ridiculous. But we got it working. And it's running and driving. So I'll give you a better picture of the car here. Those are 22s <laughs> with rubber band tires. Thanks. Them, them things, dude. Thanks be thanking. <laughs> Oh, don't uh, mind this. huh? Don't mind this. Yeah, don't mind that. We're gonna put new shocks. That's a, that's another thing. Oil change, uh, shocks for the hood. We're gonna clean it up, obviously. Um, we can't put tire sensors in it because the tire sensors are too big to fit in these tires. And we're selling this like it is. We're not gonna take these wheels off. We're just gonna sell it like it is. Yeah, you did. <clears throat> This is the interior. It's not a bad car. It's, it actually looks really nice. We're gonna clean the interior up. Um, 
Not bad. It's got floor mats in the back too. One of the other vehicles that was unplugged, like kind of like this, it was the Honda CRV that my girlfriend drives now. Um, one thing that was wrong with it is the battery light was on. And so we were just like messing around with it. We're like, why is this battery light on? And I like looked down and I just pushed on the, on the clip and it clipped in and the battery light went off and the, it started charging the battery. So there's stuff, just like little stuff like that will get you every single time. Like we were like, damn, we just got, we literally just got, you know, in other words, we got screwed over. In nicer words, we got screwed over. We thought we did because we paid a pretty penny for this car because it's nice. And yeah, it, uh, it was literally that simple. And now the car runs and drives wind just roll up and down like it's a good it's gucci now and it, it was just that little you know just those little little things that caused it